Once a drought hit and people were suffering from lack of food. On seeing that, Lord Buddha decided to call for a charity. He spread the word that on a particular day he would accept alms for charity with his own hands. He requested everyone to come with any offerings they wished to be distributed to the poor. On the day, the Lord Buddha sat under a tree to accept offerings. Many kings and noblemen came to offer so many things to Buddha. The great king Bimbisar was the first one to offer gifts. He offered incredible gifts, precious jewels, gold coins, large quantities of food. King Bimbisar also offered deeds of lands and houses to Lord Buddha. Lord Buddha accepted all the gifts by spreading his one hand only and thanked the king for the gifts. Then came the prince Ajashatru with many valuable gifts to offer to Lord Buddha. Buddha accepted his gifts by his one hand only. Many kings, nobles and merchants presented gifts to Lord Buddha. Buddha accepted all their gifts by extending his right hand. Then an old rough looking woman arrived. She saluted Lord Buddha and said eagerly, Enlightened one, I heard about your receiving gifts only today. I am a poor woman and have nothing. When I heard the news, I was eating this pomegranate. I had eaten only half of it. I have nothing else to give, so I brought along this half pomegranate. My Lord, I hope that you will accept this. Lord Buddha extended both his hands to receive the half-eaten pomegranate as a charity. Everyone was astonished to see that. One king asked respectfully, why did the Lord receive her gift with both hands and all of theirs with one hand? Lord Buddha replied gently, O kings, you all gave expensive gifts indeed, but none of you gave a tenth of what you have. Your motives were also more of glory rather than charity. This woman gave her all and gave it happily. So, I needed both my hands to receive. The purity of your intentions matter more than the amount of money you have to offer. Be a giver with all your heart and purity of soul.